Well, Michael Moore, as if it's possible, hitting a new low, now calling for the shunning of Trump supporters. Listen. A third of the country, a quarter of the country, angry, uh, intolerant, uh, hard to reconcile. But what do the rest of us have to do? You can't build a bridge to a racist or a misogynist. You know, they have, they have to be shunned and treated like we treated smokers 20 years ago. Should we really be shunning fellow Americans? Well, joining us now to react, editor-in-chief editor of Campus Reform, Lawrence Jones. Lawrence, welcome. Thanks for having me. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving to you, too. Now, this is not the first time that Michael yeah. Moore has called on anyone who voted for Donald Trump yeah. um, to be called a racist and to be really, as he said, quite, you know, directly shunned. Well, it's really lazy political commentary. Um, most people would try to figure out what went wrong, especially after you had a two-term black president that got a lot of these counties to vote for him. A lot of these congressional districts went for Barack Obama. Sure. And instead of trying to figure out what happened, what message didn't sell, these guys go to the identity uh, politics. And, and this is really the stuff that we've been reporting on at the Leadership Institute's campus reform on the college campuses, where if you have a Trump, a MAGA hat, they demonize you. If you support the president, they they assault you. Uh, these are people that don't want to get into your political ideology and have an actual debate. I have liberal friends, and we have debates over Thanksgiving tables and all that. And they don't call me names and all that, but these people are so lazy. They don't want to get into that. They just would prefer, because it's lazy, um, to demonize you. 